Hey folks, JR Strain here, and I just wanted to give a brief introduction to taking a fully loaded aircraft off from a carrier deck. In this case, it's the IJN Soryu, and I've got a B5N2 um, Kate with a torpedo and a full load of fuel, over three hours of fuel. So this is fully laden, and one of the problems we have with this operation is if you look in the upper left of my screen, uh, it's giving an indicated airspeed of three miles per hour. That's basically you know, just a little under uh, three knots that the carrier is moving over water to create that wind because we don't have wind in this mission. Um, and that's a problem. Uh, normally in World War II carrier ops, you'd turn into a 10 to 15 knot wind and um, the carrier would accelerate to 15 to 20 knots of speed to give you a net wind over the deck of you know, 25 to 30 knots, which gave you plenty of room uh, to take off from even, you know, around the area of the carrier island. Because we only have uh, three miles per hour of net wind over the deck, we're going to need every inch of deck to get airborne. And so I just wanted to uh, show proper procedure um, for doing that when you've got a, a full bomb and torpedo load and are very heavy. So the first thing I do, I use manual engine controls. So I'm going to make sure my prop pitch is full to 100%. My radiators are full open. And then I'm going to in, uh, engage my brakes. I have rudder pedals. Engage my tow brakes as I start my engine. I'm making sure my throttle is cut back to zero. Then I will check to make sure takeoff flaps are set. That's check. My brakes are engaged via my uh, tow brakes and my rudder, rudder pedal check and now I'm ready to throttle up and you'll see when I go full power that I will hold the brakes until my nose begins to kick a little bit to the left due to the yaw the various yaw forces acting on the aircraft and as soon as I beat my nose uh, kicks to the left I'll release my brakes and use my rudder pedals to stay centered and begin rolling down the deck so here we go applying full power keeping brakes keeping brakes keeping brakes Kicking left and rolling. I release my brakes and use rudder pedal to stay centered. Push stick forward. Hold stick forward. Gently lift back on the stick to achieve positive rate of climb. Gear up. And then once I'm definitely clear, I will retract flaps. And that's how it's done.